All right, hey Leo, so I just, um, I'm doing these singles read for the week. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do. I'm always gonna throw that in there until I get all of you subscribing. What's that? There ain't no harm in it. You don't gotta watch my shit all the time. It's fine. Ask, hey, I'll subscribe to you. Tell me where your channel is, what you looking at. Um, all right, I wanna tell you guys before I start, you should check out the Scorpio read because uh, they are um, heavily dealing with this sad, uh, sorry, Leo. Okay, anyways, this person that, um, watch, there's going to be a bunch of cups, watch. I'm talking to somebody specific. I mean, I had hair, like, the the features at the end of the read, it was like one person. So, it was um, light skin, red hair, curly hair, green eyes or hazel eyes, um, glasses on or off, don't matter. Um, and there was something else. I'm like, this is a person. I am talking to a person. Okay. So anyway, Leo, check out the Scorpio video, please. All right. So the person that, um, Leo will be running into the new relationship that Leo will, um, be happening upon. What is this person like? What is this person like? Oh, damn. Nobody's gotten three cards yet. Wow. Okay. Oh, my God. All right. Leo. We have the moon card. Okay. I feel like... Um, I, and I think Scorpio got a card, and it wasn't the same one, but I'm going to tell you this. Leo, you've been manifesting somebody, and I feel like you are calling in that person. All right, we have the Hierophant. You've been manifesting the person that you want. You're like, I'm the next person I come into is going to be. I just feel like you're manifesting this person, but you're manifesting marriage material, okay? And I just want to tell you that this person is marriage material that's going to be coming into your life. All right, and then you got the Six of Cups, so you know what that card is, right? Past life relationship, all right? This is a new person, somebody you have not met. If you have just recently come into contact with somebody, um, just pay, pay attention to the um, initials, the features, the attributes, and anything that you can pick up on the cards that maybe I don't even say, okay? But I do feel like, Leo, you are um, coming into, I, I, how spiritual are you? You know, all right? This person's past life relationship. So this person, um, if they are not, if it's not past life relationship, okay, and you don't know what that is, this person is going to be like, you're like, I am going to marry this person right now. I, I, I will marry you tomorrow. I want to have your kids, right? Six of cups. Look at all them babies. We're going to have a bunch of kids. We're going to run a daycare center. We're just going to have all kinds of shit going on. I want to marry you right now. I feel like that's how you are going to be, Leo. The person that you meet, you're just, oh my God, you fire signs, man. Look at, I just did one for Aries too. And I'm like, this is fucking so beautiful it's so oh i just love it look at this marriage material six of cups happy life happy wife you know how everybody says it oh my god should i even pull an attraction card i will just because the cards are so perverted that i want to see what's going on too yes i'm a perv all right leo Leo, Leo, this person that you are meeting, what's the, is the uh, attraction going to be instant? What's the sexual chemistry? Do they do it on the first date? No, I'm just joking. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day for me. I had to help my brother move. I'm a little bit tired. I meant to, um, oh my God, you gotta be choking me. Leo, I don't know who I am talking to, but some luck's Somebody's luck is about to change. I, I want to, if one more comes out, we'll see. All right. So this is only attraction, instant attraction, sexual chemistry, attraction. So we got the five of swords. All right. And I feel like this is a card. Look at that guy and that girl. They're like, I will do you up against a wall standing up. No, I'm just joking. No, I'm not. That attraction is there. Leo, you both are going to be instantly attracted to each other. And Leo, um, 
I feel like the Empress energy coming out. This is how you see this person. Okay, Leo, look at the description. Uh, look at that. Who am I talking to? Look at red hair, like curly, wavy red hair. I'm sure she's got green eyes. I can't see it. I'm too old to see that far away, I guess. I don't know. Um, no, oh, this is specific to somebody. Oh my God. Um, okay, what what else? What else can we see about this person for Leo? What what are they embodying? Are they marriage material? Are they, did that really just happen? No way. <clears throat> I don't even know. Do I pull this card or not? No, I'm not going to pull it. Let me do this. I'm going to mix it back up. If it comes out, then that's that's the, to God's honest truth. Because this is some this is a singles read for somebody who is not... Um, they don't have anybody on their mind. All right, but if this card comes back out... Oh, okay. All right. No, nope. it didn't come back out. I think it was, might have been flipped in the pile. We have Honeymoon. All right, so this person... Um, they, this is like a marriage, look at Hierophant and Honeymoon, like you guys are going to just write to it. Let's get married, let's go on a honeymoon, and when we get back, we're going to have babies. Like, I seriously feel like that's how this is. Oh my god. That's so fucking happy, man. I'm so fucking happy for whoever I'm talking to, because this is, this is fucking awesome, man. Who doesn't want this? Look at, I split the deck. Fuck. Passion. Wish fulfillment. Passion. Wish fulfillment. No, I don't read reversals. All right, so what are some challenges? Do you guys see any? I don't see any yet. And, okay. All right, so challenges right here and then what, can, what will help right here. So challenges, we have the hermit and the hangman. So I feel like, um, Leo, I feel like you're all gung ho about this person. Okay. Or they are about you. Take it, flip it how it is. I feel like this is the energy you're embodying though. I feel like you are manifesting. You're ready to go. All right. So I feel like the challenges are, um, somebody goes, takes a step back. All right. And I feel like because they recognize the depthness that is that a word depthness the depthness of this relationship so somebody's realizing whoa 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 all right um and leo hopefully you're not rushing anybody okay don't rush anybody all right and and look at all the major arcana too the moon the hierophant the hangman the hermit so of all the tarot cards we have five and there's only one minor arcana on the board right now but I feel like the challenges are somebody's going to take a step back and it's just because they need a minute. They need a minute to think about what this truly is. All right. Um, and I feel like with the, we have the seven of wands coming out. All right. I feel like what, what will help is, um, uh, if you've been in these energies in the past that didn't know what they want, the universe is saying, stop, stop living in the past. Okay. Stop living in the past. All right, because this is something new. It's not going to be like that. So if there's if somebody needs to take a step back, whether it's you or them, um, if it's them, the universe is saying it's not going to be how it was with this person because this person, um, they recognize everything just as you do. If it's you, um, that's the, if it's them that needs to take a step back, the universe is saying, hey, not every relationship is going to be like it was in the past. So so get out of that head, get out of that space because this is, this is this is guided i feel like this is divinely guided this is good i've had these maybe i shouldn't have done that twin flame thing because i feel like i'm picking up some energies from from people that are just like um it's heavy but you know what it's awesome because this is like this is awesome and for those of you who are, are who are in their heads that are like yeah 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 people keep saying people keep saying people keep saying i just want to tell you that the universe um Tarot readers are, are here for advice, all right? We're not here to predict your future. Okay, so we're here to say this is what could happen, but you have to be in the right headspace too, all right? So if you're sitting there telling yourself, that's, no, that's, some other tarot person said that too, and it still hasn't happened. Well, you have to manifest it yourself too. We're not going to predict your future for you. This is the advice we are guided to give you, okay? We're not predicting your future. So if you're, um, if you're like, yeah, fucking right, fucking little, little, little. 
guess what's going to happen? Little, little, law. They ain't going to give you anything if you're in your head about it. So what I want to tell you guys is to stay in high vibration, stay in meditation, hermit and hangman, think positive thoughts, know that shit's coming to you and know that you deserve it. Okay. Um, and it comes. So you have to believe to receive. All right. And I feel like I'm going to make that a little like insert of all my videos, because if you're not believing in shit, then you're not going to get shit, you know? So when, where, or how will we meet for Leo and this wonderful, wonderful person? All right. So we have the three of wands coming out. All right. And I feel like with this card, um, it could be somebody that you work around. I'm just looking at the, the, um, the, everything around that surrounds this person. I feel like it could be, um, at work. It could be, um, I almost, I feel like saying school for some reason. Uh, that's came up twice now and I never really feel like saying school um, but work work or um, when where or how um, a, a couple of weeks I feel like everything is coming in fast right now all right three weeks within three weeks um, I feel like this is going to be moving along very very fast um, I don't feel I'm not feeling anything other from this card Okay, but um, let me get some of the signs that you you could be dealing with. All right. Oh, Leo. Oh, let me tell you this. If this comes out, if I just I gotta do this again because this is just gonna be confirmation. I made a comment to the Scorpio about Leo because there was two cards that heavily identified with Leo and I'm like one of the signs that came out was obviously Leo all right so let's see Leo signs you could be dealing with we have Venus all right Libra um 10 so oh I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm blind 16 six and one is seven all right so within seven weeks i feel like it's going to be faster than that though we have gemini air sign all right so within three weeks uh within three months december okay um no no scorpio showed up so i, I must be talking to a different um collective but it's fine all right, so initials. Remember, if you've just met somebody and you're questioning it. Okay. O. If you see any of your initials here, it's confirmation. Um, universe saying, yes, go for it, do it. If your initials are not here, it's fine. They're just saying, um, pay attention to the initials that surround you. You. There are people with the U name. There's people with the U in their name. There has to be E. There's a lot of vowels in this one. L. C. And M. All right. And features. C. What do we got? One. Okay. So. We have dark skin. Stocky. Black hair. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. And I apologize if you can't, but whatever. We have light skin. muscular and tanned somebody likes to fake and bake maybe not fake and bake i fake and bake i was fake and baking now i sit in the sun okay leo i love you guys i hope that you enjoyed this reading i feel like i i feel so good in my heart for you guys like this is happy um pure happy and then next week i will hopefully um reach out to some new um leo energy and get some different messages out here all right bye guys